Well, I've been putting this job off now for at least a couple of months. I, um, I've been waiting for the fairies or the, uh, the Keebler elves to come and, and do this for me in the middle of the night. But guess what? The little fuckers must be on strike because um, they're not showing up. They're not doing it. What we have here is some lovely rust that's rusted out this bottom part. It's uh, it's a piece there that friggin' that holds the bottom spring on, clamps to the frame. The actual frame up the top here, there's a, there's a friggin' big hole there. But um, besides that, it's this bottom piece. Let me show you on the other side. That's the other side there. So that that piece there, it's a bit that one there, it's the one that's rusted out on that side. And uh, yeah, I've been really, 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 really avoiding this because this is a prick of a job. I've already done quite a bit of work to this trailer. This is this second hand piece of shit that I picked up with the boat when I bought it and it had uh, little 10 inch wheels on it. So what I did is I put bloody, uh, I raised the mud guards up. I, uh, I changed the, uh, changed the friggin' um, hubs on it and um, made it so it fits uh, bloody Commodore friggin' rims, which are 15s. Uh, also put brand new springs on it, uh, brand new bloody U-bolts and stuff, uh, a whole lot. Not that it looks like it, it's only friggin' it hasn't been sitting out here for very long. It's rusting to the shit, so yeah, um, ugh, what a pain in the ass. So the first thing I've got to do is roll this POS on its side which and it's going to be really heavy I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it um, I don't even have really any uh, I've got a block and tackle but I've got nothing to hook it to so not unless I try and run it over the fence to my next door neighbour's house and bloody do that but yeah alright so I'll be back maybe alright so we got this bitch undone that was fun. As you can see, this is our rust pit. We got it's actually a uh, it's actually an angle bar. Oh, fuck it, I'm panting my ass off here. Holy crap, it's hot. Oh dear. It's uh, yeah, 45 angle angle iron. Honey. So I'm gonna try and cut that off somehow <sighs> fun and replace it and patch this up while I'm at it oh man this is lots of fun yeah welcome to Australia look at that uh, not a cloud in the fucking sky and this is the middle of winter and that big bitch up there is just blazing. Holy crap, mate. Oh, uh, holy fuck, it's hot. All right, I'm gonna go inside, grab a drink, and uh, I'd like to find me hat if possible. Other than that, then I've got to try and cut this bitch off. Okay, well, we managed to pull that plate off. was a giant pain in the ass but it is off thankfully now we've got to weld up the new one and uh, here's the things that make all that bloody noise on my videos isn't that right Mr Hugo that's Hugo he's my great dame Oh, 
Your big buff head. Yes. That's Zeus. He's my English Mastiff. He knows I'm talking about him now. Isn't that right? That's Cat. She's a... Uh, also a... Oh, fuck's sake. Ow. Oh, you bugger. Oh, he fucking just jumped on me, the cunt. Ugh. That hurt. So, this is the piece that came off it. So, uh, the uh, springs get held on there. One side is sort of okay ish, the other side is very, very shit ish. But, decided we'll just replace the whole bloody lot, of course. So, we went and got <coughs> another piece, bit of gout. There we go. That's that cell. And so I don't have to try and cut these bastards off and redo them. We got those as well. All up, these cost like 50 bucks or something for those two pieces there and the 50 mil gal. Talk about fucking expensive. No wonder I bloody do this shit by um, in the salvage yards and stuff because Christ almighty. It is uh, very, very dear. Alright, so I'm going to mark these up and I'm going to weld them together. And I don't think I'm going to get it on. No, I won't get it on today at all because I've got to, uh, I've got to weld up the, uh, I've got to weld up the frame on that thing. But I can at least get these brackets on anyway. So, alright, see you when I'm finished. Alright, so that's done. Nicely welded, mounted. Should be good. And just making sure I've got them on the right way. <laughs> Otherwise that would be seriously fucked up. Yep. That's good. That'll do it. Beautiful. Alright, I just gotta paint it up. And I've got to do the rails and the and the rest of it. It's got to paint it up and um, do the rails on the actual trailer itself. So, alrighty. So, just got to now weld this up. And uh, I'll probably paint this whole trailer. Got to get all the rust off it. Put some rust converter on it. And then um, coat it all in blackjack or kill rust or something. We'll figure something out anyway. Right. Well, the sun is the setting. So it's a time for me to be getting drunk. <laughs> Alrighty. You all have a good one. Yep. Hugo says goodbye.